Hey YouTubers, Mo here from Mo's Motorcycle Journey. Just want to say thank you to everybody out there. I uh, just want to make a quick video of a situation that I had. And I didn't catch it on video because I'm upgrading my GoPro on my helmet. And the new one that I purchased was defective. Go figure. So I had to send that back. Uh, otherwise, I would have caught it on video. However, something I just want to make everyone aware of. Uh, and I'm pretty sure if you're a motorcycle rider, you probably already know about it. But uh, there's, there's a lot of new riders out there that don't know. So uh, start the intro. Okay, so I'm riding. I uh, it was temperature was about 53 degrees here in Michigan. This was last Sunday, and Sunday the uh, 13th, or no, the 20th. Excuse me, March 20th. So here I am riding. I'm coming back. I just and I wish I would have had it on video, but like I said, I, I'm upgrading all that, and I just got to finish it. But anyways. Uh, so I decided to come back and I go down a different road. Big mistake. I shouldn't have done that. I uh, apparently, I'm not sure if you guys know what alligatoring is. So alligatoring is a small series of cracks in the asphalt and or concrete. And uh, apparently they would, they put the seam of the road so the seam of the asphalt was in the center of the road. And here I am riding down, speed limit's 15, so I wasn't going very fast. But uh, my motorcycle actually hit a chunk of asphalt in the road and it kicked up, hit the bottom of the motorcycle, kicked the whole motorcycle over. Luckily I wasn't going too fast because uh, I'm, I'm sure I would have dumped. Uh, luckily I, I had it under control, but the asphalt hit the bottom cowl, which is the fairing cowl, right at the bottom that holds the fog lights in, and knocked off my belly pan. So I'm just going to let you gold wingers know right now, if you don't have a belly pan, get a belly pan. Because that's the only thing that has saved my motorcycle from any damage was that belly pan. So thank God I had that belly pan on there. And it wasn't, you know, just a little three-inch piece of asphalt. It was probably eight inches wide. Uh, after I went, I, I did take some pictures of it, a small video. Uh, I went back in my car the next day and uh, filmed it. but And it looked like couple cars have ran over it and broke it up some more so there's there's smaller pieces but I just wanted to point that out to all the motorcycle riders out there especially ones that are heavy motorcycles uh, because when you're riding you can actually hit this stuff and it can dump you so it's very dangerous especially right after winter time you know, when roads are, frost is coming out of the ground and things are starting to readjust, be very careful out there, guys. It, it is, it's just, I'm saying this, be very careful. So, um, like I said, I'll throw a little video up, uh, what happened to my cycle. And, I mean, it wasn't that bad. The belly pan took a little while to get back on there. Uh, it was, it, it saved my motorcycle. Uh, so, like I said, if you don't have one, definitely get one. Um, but anyways, I just wanted to make a quick video to let you guys know about this. Be careful of any areas where there is alligatoring. Now, when you're doing 60 miles an hour, you're not going to see this. This was in a community. Speed limit's 15. And, you know, so this is going to be for, like, all apartment complexes or mobile home communities or any parking lot out there can have this. So I just want people to be aware and be careful. 
okay? Uh, but other than that, guys, again, if you haven't subscribed and you just stumbled across my channel, click that subscribe button. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, hit the bell notification. YouTube will let you know every time I upload a video. With that being said, guys, remember, if you don't make the choice, the choice makes you. Have a good one, guys. Talk to you soon.